guys welcome back to my reaction channel today we're going to react into bleach greatness thousand year blood war uh, core 2 episode 3 dubbed version as always like i said every wednesday when i have the time and i thought i wasn't gonna have time today but i'm like yo i i, I need to remember everything about this core before uh, the core 3 comes in october and uh, there's not much time left right especially when i'm going at this pace so uh, I tried to make some time and it looks like I made it so we're gonna jump straight into this the first two episodes lit I love the dub voice the dub voices are amazing in the show I'm sorry bro people keep nagging me like oh sub is better bro no no it's not no no it's not <laughs> like uh, one day I'm gonna watch Naruto and sub as well because people keep kept telling me there that sub was better but dub was amazing and, and bleach dub is amazing and I've seen core 2 I think yeah in, in sub because dub didn't even come out then now i'm watching in dub and i've seen some sub voices and it's not bad but i'm sorry bro dub is way way better <laughs> like for me like i just enjoy the dub bro so if the dub is good i'm gonna watch the show in dub it's just easier that being said i ain't gonna pull on this that much if you enjoy my reactions feel free to share subscribe like leave a comment join the patreon support your boy discord second channel let's go man let's see yeah, post invasion. Yeah, the invasion is happening. That's the best you can do. That's enough, Basby. Huh? Back off. <laughs> He's this mine. Is mine. You stealing my killed song, do? Yo, yo! Oh, I forgot Hungy about girl. that. She She's slit her throat. Lieutenant, isn't she? It's only right she should die by your side. Yuri Maru. This must be your first time seeing it from the other side. It's a beautiful Bankai. I am truly sorry. Bro, I'm sorry. I, I ain't even gonna lie. I forgot half of these scenes, bro. I completely forgot that he kept Rangiku close under his cloak. And under his cloak. And he slit her throat a bit, right? She's still alive, but barely. And now he's flexing on him with his own wings. That's crazy. Urahara found a way to get our Bankai's back, oh, though. Through. Wait, is that... It's me, Kisuke. Yeah, where would we be without Kuratsuchi and, and Kisuke? Let's be honest, bro. Brains what are everything. What did you say? That you discovered a way of reclaiming Bankai? Yeah, well, to be more precise... I discovered a weakness in the method the Quincy's used to steal Bankai. But fix a communication device to my clothing without my permission is a serious crime. Okay, okay, but wait, 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 you're not gonna cut me off, are you? Goodbye. Oh, come on, are you serious? Don't hang up. Well, that was kind of rude. <gasps> so, can I count on your help? Captain. Hey, you gotta set your pride on the side, bro. I'm sorry. And don't, don't forget, Kisuke was the one that released you from your prison, right? Ask you to join him and all that by in the backstory? No, but where would the Serate be without Kuratsuchi and Kisuke? I'm sorry, bro. These two mother efforts solved all the problems. Every time! Confirm the locations of all captains and lieutenants. Do you know why I chose to remain in Waco Mundo even after hearing the reports of captains having their Bankai stolen from them? It wasn't because I was working on my tan. If a captain's Bankai can be stolen, the same should apply to the resurrection of an Iran car. However, I haven't found evidence that any Iran car has ever had its resurrection stolen. As you said, based on all your research into Hollows, there is no reason why Quincy's can steal Bankai, but not resurrection. Therefore, we must assume it is not to their advantage to steal it. Send a black pill to each of you along with this message. This Shineyaku only reacts to those who possess Bankai. Bruh, how the hell did he transmit that so fast and got the pills to them as well, bruh? Urahara, the goat, bruh. The goat of this show. This is crazy. I forgot half of this shit. This is all new material to me for some reason. This is crazy. Now go ahead and touch it with your hands, your feet, or your soul. The pill will be absorbed at the point of contact. Yeah, I also have a question. Uh, considering he's transmitting this, his voice throughout the Serate, can't the Quincy's hear him too? <laughs> or is it telepathical, right? This is, yo, when two geniuses meet, they're solving all the problems. I'm sorry. And I think half of these scenes seem new to me because the dub, bro, it's just so different. It explains differently. Like, when I was watching in sub, 
Like I was focusing a lot on the subtitles and the explanation and it kind of dragged out. But w when I can just right, relax and actually focus on the scenes, this is why I enjoyed the, the dub more. Sure, in sub, I can also see the scenes and read, like, right? But when they explain something complicated, I need to focus more on the subtitles than the actual scene. So now when I'm actually focusing on the scene and getting shit explained to me while I'm watching it, it seems like new material because I'm like, yo, 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 I never experienced it this way, right? So, yeah, dub over sub. When dub is good, bro, dub is lit. I've long suspected that their hostility towards the Hollows is not based on resentment as legends would have it. Hostility, especially hostility of such an enduring nature, usually arises from a difference in ideology, but that's not the case with hollows. You could say it's almost like Quincy's are a breed that hasn't developed any antibodies against hollows. The very existence of hollows is poisonous to Quincy's. So, if we were to absorb just a small amount of hollow power... And oh, so they didn't see it or hear it, because Hitsuga is doing it right in front of this dude, right? So... Okay, he's gonna counterattack and get his Bankai back in the last possible second thanks to Urahara. That transmission was legendary, bro. I'm sorry, bro. Everything Urahara did planned this out perfectly. He was able to say all that, get that in front of him without this guy, Quince, even noticing? Ah, that's impressive. Qualify our Bankai even for a moment. Then our Bankai will become poison to the Quincy's too. Yo. But this guy's impressive, but oh, the lieutenant. Oh, so you still have the will to resist even after your captain has fallen. Captain, of course. <laughs> Who wouldn't be woken up by that obnoxious voice shouting at them? She doesn't like Kiske. <laughs> nah, bro, Kiske is doing. I'm sorry, Kiske is doing something right. He has two people. Hating his guts, and both of them are captains, Kudatsuchi and Soifon. Legendary status. Get ready, Moreccio. Brace yourself. I'm ready. I wouldn't push him too far. I don't think he's crazy about being forced to hurt himself. <laughs> so Bankai doesn't have a soul of its own? I can't <laughs> believe you actually think that. See? But apparently that is what he thinks. I'm not sure what's going on with my face, but he did say something about temporarily holifying Bankai. Became a uh, wiser. <laughs> there, that ought to do it. He looks cool. Hang on, Rangiku. Yeah, Rangiku Hang is. On. I'm coming. Who was this? Yo, see, I, I forgot everything, bro. Who the hell was the one that approached, uh, was it? I cannot remember. For the life of me, I can't remember. Who approached Toshiro? You're probably thinking I should surrender, since I love I'm him. so hopelessly outnumbered. And in Core 3, we're getting his Bankai, I think. So that's dope. <laughs> But even though I'm pissed off about you killing my comrades, there are certain techniques I can finally use now that they're gone. Is that Yushikai or Bankai? Bankai. Oh, it's ba- yeah! Yo, I'm- Yokoshima The way enemies and allies are all mixed up in the Serite right now, I can't just use it whenever and wherever I want. They're able to hide in the shadows, right? There's no telling where they might jump out from next. Yeah. They could be- yeah, this guy. I didn't like this guy. He looks way too goofy. <laughs> Especially when you're fighting a superstar! <laughs> He's annoying. What the hell? <laughs> Where the heck did everyone go? Now you've got me looking like I'm out here talking to myself! Huh? Lil? Gigi? Doggy? <laughs> what are you wearing that bucket for? Is it because you're too scared to look me in the eye? I don't have time to deal with you. Maybe so. Mm -hmm. But if that's the case, then I guess you'd have to say we're not very good heroes. Yeah, I we forgot about this. We just don't have the patience to stand around and wait until the Seirite is totally torn apart. This won't stop me! I told you it would be difficult. It's backwards! <laughs> Oh, 
Oh. Not bad. Right to the face. It has come at last. Rejoice, stern Ritters. Yeah, this was annoying. <laughs> you shall soon come to regret regaining your Bankai Soul Reapers. Yeah, your they're ready. Your dream of a righteous battle brimming with hope and warmth. True despair begins now. <clears throat> yeah, that was equally badass at uh, in sub. Is there an end credit scene? Why do I overcomplicate everything? <laughs> it's so close. And yet so far. And my man battling the universe. It happened again. Yeah. You better keep moving. Multiple eyes. Creepy as hell. Oh, here come the poems. In my heart. Mm, badass. Badass. I love those poems. But uh, regardless, yo, half of this episode, I don't remember. I, I, I'm telling you, like, they're explained way better in dub. And I just love the, the, the fact that the voices are actually good, right? So I, I, I love the dub. I'm sorry. Bleach dub is, is supreme. And uh, Naruto dub as well, bro. I never heard Naruto sub, but I would imagine the sub is good. But it's definitely equal, if not better, in the dub. And Bleach? Bro, I would say Bleach dub is better than the sub, bro. I'm sorry. <laughs> I know the sub fanatics are gonna kill me, but for me, bro, they explained better in the dub, especially in this episode. And uh, yeah, I think I actually missed a lot while I was watching in sub explanation wise. But now it's a bit better. This was a good idea, man. This was a good idea. This was a very good episode, bro. This core was very good, bro. <laughs> like, this is really, really good. Yeah, th these aren't even the hype episodes, bro. I'm sorry. When 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 Hitsugaya regained his Bankai, bro, that was, that was, that was badass. That was badass. And when the Quincy's now got their powers back, that was less badass, but I, I enjoyed it. But the, most of this episode was legendary, man. Very good. And I even got surprised on a few fronts, because like I said, I forgot half of this. Like, I was like, hey, yo. And I still can't remember who came to Hish like Hitsugaya's aid. Who was it? Was it Grimja? I know Grimja is going to appear in one of these episodes, but I don't think that that's it. Maybe it is Grimja. I, I don't know. I know somebody shocking uh, is going to come to Hitsugaya's aid. But I can't remember. For the life of me, I can't remember. Did they even reveal it? Maybe they didn't even reveal Did they, they definitely reveal it. I don't know, bro. <laughs> but I am enjoying the hell out of these, brother. Dub, dub, dub is legendary. I, I'm sorry. Bleach dub is superior. Fight me in the comments. That being said, I ain't gonna this that much. I really enjoyed this episode. Hope you enjoyed the reaction. And I'll see you on the next one. Stay safe. Love you. Enjoy. And bye.